name is Brad Smith. I play for the band Blind Melon. My name is Sam Daggett. I play in Rainbow Jackson. My knee jerk on coated strings is to stay away from it. Mostly I've just always gone with uncoated because it's what's been around for so long. Tried them and didn't really dig them all that much. I think our coated strings I've used kind of they get a little bit gunky. And I, I feel like the coating compromises the tone. Well, it really dampens the tone, uh, makes the strings feel dead too soon. It's tough. I mean, it's really hard to tell the difference. They don't feel that different. I'd have to guess. Okay. But honestly, it's not jumping out at me. I don't know. I mean, if I had to pick... I think this one just sounds a little bit, just a little bit brighter. This one seems to have a little more output, a little louder. This one's louder for sure. That's amazing. I would guess... This one has the coated strings. Like what I'm used to hearing, I'd have to guess that this one was probably the steel. I would say that this is the coated string and this is the non-coated. I'm Jason, I took the clear tone challenge and I failed. These don't feel anything like coated strings I've played before. It seems almost impossible to tell the difference, really. My name is Sam Daggett, I just failed the clear tone challenge. I'm definitely going to start trying these out. That's, uh, that's pretty impressive. That's, I'm impressed by that. I think that uh, this is significantly better. The taboo is broken. I'm Brad Smith. Uh, I've been around music for a long time and played lots of different strings and I have failed the clear tone challenge.